Hey, what's up guys? I'm Tiger with Tiger Comedia back with another Dokkan battle video. So, since things went so well with that all Vegeta team yesterday, you know we have to come back and try it out again with an all Goku team this time. So today guys, we are taking on the Pure Saiyans Super Battle Stage once again, but this time with an all Goku, Goku's family team. And here is the setup for today's run. So we have my personal LR Super Saiyan 4 Goku with a single dupe in him. I know not super impressive, but that's all I got. And aside from that, the rest of the team looks like this. We got my AGL Super Saiyan 3 Goku, fully duped out. And I'm using him over the LR, mainly because my LR doesn't have any dupes in him. So I feel like this guy's going to be a lot more reliable. And we also have the Int LR Super Battle Road Goku here for support and some stunning. We have the AGL Transforming Goku for some tanking. He has three dupes in him as well, so he should be pretty damn strong. And we also have this Super Saiyan 3 Xeno Goku, who is mainly here for a little bit of tanking, but also for stunning. And last but not least, we have my personal uh, UI Goku. I almost said LR. I wish, <laughs> I wish it was an LR. But we have the Rainbow Int UI Goku. And we also have a friend, unfortunately not rainbowed, but with three dupes, so close enough, and it also has three dodge, which I like a lot for Super Battle Road, so um, hopefully the friend will be the MVP of this run. And without further ado, guys, let's jump in and see what happens. Now, if you guys haven't seen my all Vegeta run for this stage, uh, definitely go check it out. It was one of my best Super Battle Road runs, like, basically ever. Like, the RNG was awesome, the units were doing additionals, we were getting crits, we were getting stuns. Uh, it was an awesome, awesome run. So go check it out, guys. But first, let's uh, focus on this and see how we can do if we can get a repeat of what happened last time. And um, I mean, I, oh, man, here's the thing. The issue with this team compared to the Vegeta team is that there's no like insanely awesome tank like the STR Super Saiyan 3 Vegeta um, on the Vegeta's team. For this team, we have some good tanks, but no one that really stands out like that, right? So we're going to pop the Icarus. Just be safe. Safety first. And then we are going to go for Trunks here with the Xeno Goku. And we can get an Ultra Super off. Let's keep going for Trunks. Let's just take him out. And uh, obviously we're going to go for Goten here with the Int LR Goku. Okay, man. Yo, show me something good. Come on. Yeah, as long as I'm taking less than like 50k. Oh, 12k. Actually, that's not bad. That's not bad. Okay, what's, go what's Goten going to do? Goten's doing 14k. I can definitely live with the... Yo, know, my words are not working today. Uh, I can live with that. I can live with that. We did not get the stun off. That's unfortunate. But we did uh, get some good tanking in. So we're doing okay so far. We're doing okay so far. I wish there was like an equivalent to the uh, STR Super Saiyan 3 Vegeta on this team. Man, it would make things so much easier. But we don't have that guy. But like I said, there are some good tanks in this game. We're on this team, uh, in this category. So, oh, we got the stun off with the LR Goku. That's dope. It's like a rare chance, I'm pretty sure. Wait, is it medium chance or rare chance? Hold on. I'm pretty sure it's a rare, yeah, it's a rare chance. That's like 10%. So the 30% didn't go off with the Xeno Goku, but the 10% with the LR Goku went off. That's cool, that's cool. Okay, um, so for this rotation, our best tank is probably... Um, I mean, okay, so this guy's going to get better over time as he transforms through the stages, but right now it looks like it's going to be our Super Saiyan 3 Goku here. So I'm actually going to take UI. Um, actually, I don't know if I should. Uh, I was going to take UI out of rotation, but then we don't have good links for the Super Saiyan 3 Goku, so... Okay, okay, we'll, we'll, we'll go with this, we'll go with this. Let's keep going for Trunks, we're going to try to kill him as soon as possible. Uh, possibly in this rotation if we can, but we can't go for Trunks with the UI, so we're going to go with that. And then we're going to go back to Trunks. Uh, maybe some, maybe like we get, if we get like additional, like some crits and some additionals, we can possibly actually kill Trunks here. And that would make my life a lot easier. Because I only have to go. Okay, okay. Additional? Oh my god, yo. <laughs> what is up with the good RNG these days, man? I mean, aside from summons, obviously. Basically, everything besides summons um, has been good. Okay, 151k. That, that That's quite a bit of damage. That, that's definitely quite a bit of damage, but you know what? We're still above half health right now. So, we're staying alive. Okay. 38k. That's not bad. Next turn, we're going to use the Princess Snake. But I think Trunks should be dead. Ooh, that's rough. That is a rough one. You know what, though? Um, Trunks is going to be dead after this, so we don't have to worry too much about those attacks. 
at the end. I think. I I, I think um, we actually have enough damage just from a normal attack to kill him. I, I hope so at least. But I'm definitely gonna pop the Persistent Snake here, just to heal up a little bit, get that damage reduction, and then. Um, I guess I'll give these orbs to Goku. I really hope it's enough, man. Like, I really sincerely hope that's enough to, to kill the Trunks, because otherwise we're going to take a lot more extra damage than we have to. Okay, he's dead. Good. Um, 35k. Th okay, that's okay. 37k, 35k. Can we get the stun this time? 30% chance. Medium chance to stun. Let's go. <sighs> well, that's... Uh... That's frustrating. All right, all right. That's fine. That's fine. I can, I can, I can deal with that. Um, we are going to put this guy in front, and the UI at the back is fine. Okay. Possibly get another stun off with the, the Intel R Goku, even though, like I said, it's 10% chance, and he's been doing okay for me so far. So can we keep that going? Can we keep that momentum? All right, 1.9 mil once again. Give me another crit. Give me another additional. All right, got the crit. No additional. That's okay. Alright, crit. No stun, 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 stun. No stun this time. Oh! I thought it was, I thought it was an additional. I thought we got an additional. That's okay though. Man, without that like insane tank. Yeah, without that insane tank in the Super Saiyan 3 Vegeta, like, it really does make things a lot harder. It really does. Ooh, active skill time. Yeah, let's, okay, let's, let's pop this first. Gonna pop this first. Let's, let's just kill him. Come on, come on, go. Kill your son. Kill your son. Yo, last time Vegeta, alright, last time Vegeta killed Trunks and he felt good about it, alright? So if you. It's, it's fine, don't worry about it. No one's gonna judge you. Alright, one mil. Um, let's see. Wait, does, does, does this Goku guard against attacks? I think he. Oh, no, he, he has damage reduction, right? That's why he's a good tank. Okay, he has, he has the damage reduction. Okay. Um. Unfortunately, we can't get a super here, so we might have to actually put him there. I'm a little bit scared though, not gonna lie. Um, a little bit concerned, because Goku does not become a good tank. Like, LR Super Saiyan 4 Goku, Goku does not really become a tank until uh, you get that super off, so I'm just praying to God right now we don't get super in the first slot. Okay, we're not getting super. We're taking a regular hit for 27k. That's okay, we can live with that. All right, just kill your son. Come on, die, go ten. Just die for me. Ooh. Oh, oh, oh. Okay, that's okay. That's okay. No more attacks after that. So that's it. Okay, we're done there. We're done there, guys. That's all right. Crisis averted. Nothing to worry about here. Um, still on a good pace, actually. On a really, really good pace because we only have what, like, two items used. We still have six items. Um, should I pop a? I think I'm probably gonna pop a Icarus. Ooh, let's let's pop a Whis. Let's pop a Whis. Just be extra safe here. And then, um, hmm. Let's put this guy here. Yeah, I don't know actually. Go tanks with those attacks. It's. Uh, I mean, he has the highest defense though. <sighs> I think with the Whis, we should be okay. I should be okay with the Whis. Famous last words once again. Who knows, man? <laughs> I could be dead. I could be dead. Who knows? Um, but sometimes you gotta take those risks, man. Sometimes the super battle, you just gotta take those risks. You never know what's gonna happen. Uh, but, wow, 48 damage. Okay, we're fine. <laughs> we are just fine. 2.6 mil. Give me a crit. Come on. Come on. 1.7 mil. Nice. And an additional. Okay. I, I was so right to bring this guy. So right to bring this dude over the LR. Because the LR would not be doing that right now. I mean, the LR might be tanking decently without the 12 key, but then he's also doing no damage, right? So this guy is much, a much better balance of damage and defense, in my opinion. Um, if I had, like, my LR Super Saiyan 3 Goku Rainbow, yeah, I, I probably would have brought him. But since I have no dupes in him, and I have this, I have the AGL Rainbow, I'm like, it's a no-brainer. It, it, it's definitely a no-brainer. So that was a smart choice. We got the stun once again with the LR Goku as well. Uh, that's freaking clutch. And we got the UI Goku transformation. As dope. Uh, I think we still have... I believe we still have the... Oh yeah, we do. No, it's only the second turn. So we have the UI... Um, not the UI Goku. The 
what I'm trying to say, we have the Whis active, right? So I don't have to pop an item again for this turn. Um, should I put UI at the end or in the front? Probably in the front, right? Okay, so we got two Gohan attacks in the front, one at the back. Oh, we have three in the front actually. So let's help with that. This thing, I don't, I don't know if I should trust UI because there's so many times where like he's transformed, and you have that like super high chance to dodge, but he still doesn't dodge, and then I just died, right? So I'm a little bit concerned. I'm a little bit concerned right now, guys. <sighs> what should I do? What should I do? I'm gonna put. I'm gonna leave. Uh, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna leave in there. I'm gonna leave this rotation as is. Can we get the Ultra Super off? I think this is enough to get the Ultra Super with the Goku. There we go. And then you can take these, and then we will go for Go Tanks with the UI. All right. There we go, yo. First, uh, I, no, I I saw like you know it was a super, but then we got the little flash. Yo, we got the counter. Good RNG once again. That's beautiful. 32k. That's okay. That's okay. 30, 32k is nothing. Not for Super Battle Road. All right. Gohan's almost dead. Got that? Okay, Gohan's dead. <laughs> Gohan is officially, officially dead. I think. Or, or very close, at the very least. Wow. Well, I mean, hey, even though we didn't kill him, we got so much defense with those supers that uh, he did, what, 52 damage to us. And now we just have to worry about the Gotenks. Got a nice... Come on. Show me something good. Show me something good, Goku. 1.1 mil. That was okay. That was okay. Um, let's pop the Princess Snake once again. I really, really want to save that token attack, though, if, if, if at all possible. Definitely want to save that token attack. Um, let's see. Yeah, let's let's go. Um, let's go with this actually. Let's go with that, and then we'll give him that. Can we save some. Uh, actually, he can get get that super off with these, and then that's an ultra super right there. Perfect, perfect. So, I was keeping my own LR Super Saiyan 4 Goku in rotation just because it's LR Super Saiyan 4 Goku, but I'm just like, you know what? I, I think having the, the Super Saiyan 3s linked together is actually more useful um, of a rotation because the LR Super Saiyan 4 just does not link well with the Super Saiyan 3s, right? Um, and as you can see, we got that. <laughs> we got that stun off. So I'd rather have the Xeno Goku in rotation with the stuns and the tanking um, because I feel like it's more just more useful overall. Okay. So, anyways, uh, let's pop this active skill here. And give me a nice crit, Goku. Come on. Give me a crit. I know he's half your son this time and you already killed your son one time. But you gotta do what you gotta do, man. Sometimes Super Battle Road, you got no options. Okay, there we go. 2 mil. 2.4 mil. That's. Oh, dude, that's nice. That is so freaking nice. I don't have to worry about anything, right? Because um, he's stunned. So let's just go with that. Let's give him these. And then I think he can get an ultra super off too. Wow, those are some good orbs right there. And we did not got, get the Dokkan attack. So actually, we better finish this rotation. Like, finish this fight right here on this rotation. Yeah? Oh, there we go. Okay, he's dead. Perfect, and we got the Dokkan attack right off the bat for the for the next fight. Yo, this is going almost as well. I, I'd say like very close, if not as well as the Vegeta fight. All right, so um, I, I guess this goes to show, man. If both the Vegeta, the full Vegeta team, and the full Goku team can take on Pure Saiyans, no problem. If you got the right units, of course. But as you guys can see, I don't have the perfect units, right? I just have like you know good units, but not all of them are rainbowed. I'm not like truth you know with like a full rainbow team or anything like that i just have some like decent units with some orb investment some dupe investment and uh things are going pretty well right now but i should shut up right now because just in case just in case things go south i don't want to look stupid um let's pop the let's pop the icarus here because you know we got the we got the dokkan attack but I, we still uh we still got some attacks coming in too yeah Man, UI, UI at the end really does bother me, but um, it'll be okay, right? <laughs> I mean, we don't have type disadvantage back there, so it shouldn't, shouldn't be too big of a problem. 
Okay, okay. Dokken attack. Uh, Dokken attack. Time. Yeah. Let's go for. Let's go for the Goku Jr. Actually, and we will give these to him. But should I attack? Do I still attack Goku Jr.? Why not? Okay, we'll go for Goku Jr. We'll go for. We'll, for, we'll go for Goku, Goku Jr. I guess it doesn't really matter that much. Okay. Let's focus. Let's focus. Come on. One, two, three, four, five, six. You know what it is? I, I feel like for Dokkan attacks, the it's the slow ones that get me, man. Cause I'm so anxious to like hit those nodes that sometimes I click too fast. When it's the fast ones, man, like I'm ready. Like I'm already like prepared. My body is ready for it to go really fast, right? So I'm just like boom, 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 boom. Easy, done, no problem. But when it's the slow ones, it really messes with me. So that one was actually probably tougher than it would have been if it was really really fast I know stun that time that's okay that's okay All right, 17k um considering <laughs> considering he has guard activated and we took 17k I am a little bit nervous about a potential super um on UI 14k okay 14k okay yep there, there's a super we do have Whis active so we should be okay okay one one eight five k and we're healed back to full. All right, we still got the Whis, so we should be fine. Um, here we go, guys, here we go. <sighs> let, me, let me look at this defense. The defense is not great. The defense is not great. But um, we already got supered by Goku Jr. So if we are getting a super, it's probably gonna be Vegeta Jr. And Vegeta Jr. has the type disadvantage. Um, we're obviously gonna go full on uh, Vegeta Jr. here, just try to take him out. Hey, this is three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and nine orbs right there. This is eight. So let's go for this. And I say nine because uh, the Super Saiyan four gets three key from Rainbow Orbs. Just to just to be clear. Um, so we'll give him these. All right, just just short, like one key short of an Ultra Super. That's okay. That's okay. All right, eleven k. All right, so we're getting the super now. So once we super, we're gonna get a lot higher defense, like a huge increase in defense. So I'm not worried about the attacks that come after. Ooh, nice. 1.7 mil. See, look, look at the huge drop in, in, in damage received, guys. It's, it's, it's crazy. It's night and day, man. Like, we went from taking, like, oh, I don't even know what it was. Was it, like, 10,000, 20,000, or even more, to taking double digits after that? Ooh, okay, okay. I, I, I know things are going well. I, I'm feeling really good right now, but I also don't want to get overconfident. <laughs> Overconfidence is a killer. In, in Super Battle Road, more so, more so than um, you know, bad RNG or anything. Overconfidence will will get you, man. So we're gonna pop the Whis here. I don't even care if we're wasting an item. Uh, we're probably not, anyways. We're, we're probably not. So uh, let's put the guy, this guy back here, and we're gonna try to take out uh, Vegeta Jr. here. If not, if that's not enough, then we'll go with him too. And if that's not enough, we'll go with the. LR Goku as well. So no matter what, Vegeta Jr. is dead this turn. 1, 2, 3. Alright, 2.1 mil. Let's kill him. Yes. Oh, so close. That's okay, that's okay. We still got the Whis active. We still got very high defense. So, uh, this guy is good. Getting supered by Vegeta Jr. Once again, type of disadvantage. I'm expecting 10k maybe, 20k? 41k? Close enough, close enough. By the way, I don't know if you guys saw, but my Xeno Goku has no dupes in him. Like, not a single dupe. And uh, he's actually doing really well. And, and, yo, we're getting such good stun RNG, man. And it's crazy because this dude, the, the LR Goku, has a 10% chance, whereas the uh, Xeno Goku should have a 30% chance. Let me just be completely sure. I've been saying this whole, the whole time. Uh, it says medium chance of stunning. Yeah, medium chance, so that's 30%, but I'm pretty sure the Int LR Goku has stunned more. Uh, oh wait, hold on. Does he also have a chance to stun on his super attack? Uh, no, medium chance to evade. Uh, yeah, so no stun on the super attack. It's literally just on, or on the passive, it's literally just on the super. Um, but yeah, we've been stunning a lot. It's crazy, holy crap. All right, so definitely the MVP of this run. Let's actually pop this up. Um, and let me turn on the sound. I, you know what? You guys have heard it. Forget it. Yo, it's too much trouble. Too much trouble to like, you know, unmute stuff and like turn up the sound and everything. And I have to do more edits. You guys get the point. I, I'm not gonna do that this time, but <laughs> it's out there, guys. If you really want to hear it, it's, it's out there. 
Um, I think Whis is still active. Is Whis active? Oh, it doesn't really matter. He, uh, he's not even... He, 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 what do you call it? Um, he's stunned right now. We're all good. We're all good. Uh, man, those, those AGL orbs, though. Those AGL orbs. Should I take him out? Oh. Yeah, okay. Let's do this. Let's do this. Give him those AGL orbs. Get that ultra super off. I think we got this, guys. I think we do. I think we do. Once again, don't get too overconfident. Nothing's over until it's over. All right, nothing is over until it's over. But we're getting close to the point where we can officially celebrate. <laughs> Super Bad Road gets me like this, man. I swear, like, this mode makes me anxious, man. It gives me so much anxiety. All right, 1.7 mil. And, ooh, okay, you know what? I said I wasn't gonna do the active skill, but if we're gonna end it off like this, I gotta. I really gotta. Okay, give me one sec, guys. We're gonna turn up the volume and then unmute desktop. That is, I mean, it doesn't get more perfect than that, guys. We ended off the Vegeta family, like full Vegeta team showcase or uh, Super Battle Road run with the Vegeta, like uh, active skill, the ultimate attack. And then we did the same thing with the Goku here, man. That, I, you can't write that. You can't plan that because you never know what Super Battle Road, right? Like it, it's literally random, um, but that's fantastic. I could not have asked for a better finish. Oh, thank you, DJ Shepard, by the way. I would have added you, but uh, once again, no friend space, no space on the friends list, so I'm, that's my bad. But thank you, DJ Shepard, for the assist in beating the stage with that full Goku's family team. And uh, this is the team, guys. All Goku's, Goku's family, pure Saiyan Super Battle Road. We got it done once again, just like the Vegeta one. Like I said, guys, go watch the Vegeta one. Um, it went really, really well, but this one, I think, is right up there, man. Like... These videos have had really good RNG. Um, I don't think I've played them perfectly, but <laughs> the RNG made up for it. The RNG saved my ass, and uh, that was a lot of fun. That was a lot of fun. Once again, uh, I'm gonna tell you guys to let me know in the comments down below what you thought about this video, and also give me some suggestions about what theme teams you wanna see me take into Super Battle Road for different events and stuff like that. Um, obviously, there's more options with Pure Saiyans, but there's also uh, probably some other ideas you could throw out there for, I don't know, transformation boost or something like that. So let me know in the comments down below what you guys want to see and I will make it happen or try my best to if I have the right units. Uh, if not, then obviously I can't. But um, yeah, guys, that's going to do it for today's video. Hope you guys enjoyed it as much as I did because I really had a lot of fun making this for you. And uh, as always, if you guys liked the video, then make sure to like the damn video. And if it's your first time watching me, first time to the channel, and you'll like what you see, then definitely hit that big red subscribe button to join the Tiger Squad now. And while you're at it, hit that notification bell too so that YouTube knows you want to stay up to date with all my latest content. And that's it. I'm out of here. Hope you guys have a fantastic, fantastic day. I'm Tiger with Tiger Uppercut Media. Signing out.